Hey, what's up? So, how do you record beautiful clips like this one? <laughs> I'm a living legend. You ain't heard yet, you not get the message. And this one. with your Oculus Quest. Well, that's a good one. Today I'm going to share the secret of setting it all up. I hope this is going to be useful to you. If you have been wondering for a while now how to do it, then this is the video you wanna watch. So let's uh, get right to it. It's time to jump into the metaphors and uh, have some fun. Let's go. Okay, so here we are in the menu of the Oculus Quest and from here, we can start recording. Trust me, it's super duper easy. Let me uh, show you how to do it. So you simply have to go to uh, sharing and then you hit record. That's pretty much it. Straightforward, right? And uh, yeah, the moment you, uh, you start recording, it will uh, automatically show a little red icon in your HUD that will tell you, hey, I am still running. You can record for as long as you want. So if you want to do it for an hour, you can. If you want to do it for 10 minutes, then that's totally uh, up to you. And you can access the menu from wherever you want. So if you are in a mid game, you can just go here and uh, start recording too. It doesn't really uh, matter. So the moment you stop, it will save a file that will then go to the Oculus Gallery that you can find in uh, Navigate and it will pop up in the internal uh, storage. There we have it. So here are a couple of clips I have been recording on my quest in the past. This one is from uh, Super Hot. Now let's say you want to share this, uh, this clip with your friends by uploading it to YouTube or Facebook. Well, then you gotta pull off another trick. And to be able to show you how, I will have to go back to reality. So see you in just a bit. Okay, so to make the magic happen, you actually have to transfer those video files we just recorded on the Oculus Gallery to our PC. And to do that, you need a cable. Sadly, there is no other way of doing this at the moment. You can't just put on your Oculus Quest and upload your, your favorite clips from there to whatever platform. Oculus uh, hopefully is working on a feature that allows you to do that. We'll see, time will tell. Let's, uh, let's move on. There are two cables you can use for this uh, occasion. You can go for the charging cable that comes with the Oculus Quest. This is a uh, USB Type-C to USB Type-C by the way. But this is only for, for folks out there who actually have a motherboard that supports a USB Type-C. If you don't, then you have to uh, buy an extra cable and that is a USB Type-C to USB. And this works exactly the same. So this should do the trick. If you're not completely sure what you have, just go to your computer, go to the back, look at your, your, your motherboard and see what, uh, what parts it has. Maybe you're lucky, maybe not, but these cables aren't that expensive. So now it's time to uh, hook the Quest up to our PC. So uh, the, of course, uh, USB Type-C goes into the, into the Quest itself, like you do when you're charging it, and the other part goes into the computer. I'm going to use a USB in, uh, in this case. So yeah, the moment you then connected it and you turned the VR headset on, you will hear that familiar window sound. You can open the folder of the Quest, but you will see that it's empty because you first have to give permission to access the files from the headset. So you have to put your Oculus Quest on one more time and hit allow. When you did that, everything will appear. To find your video uh, files, you have to go to Oculus, Video Shots, and there you will be able to find all the clips you were looking for. 
you can then decide what you want to transfer to your computer you can do it at any location and yes in the end it's uh, it's up to you if you want to straight away upload these clips to a video platform or first go into post-production i can give you a quick heads up that the files are mp4 they aren't crazy big but that's also because of the fact that the resolution of these videos are 1024 by 1024 and that the frame rate is variable this means that it can peak but it can also drop at any time if this does happen a lot then it can cause loads of desync and audio so beware. And that ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, is how you record with the Oculus Quest. So again, I hope there will be an easier way because plugging in that cable every day to uh, transfer some of those files is, is, is annoying, I, I agree. But for content creators like me, this is a uh, awesome option to be, uh, to be playing around with. But if you are a regular consumer, I do understand you are looking for a more casual way. So if you have any, any questions, be sure to drop them in the comments below. Happy to help you out. And uh, now it's time for me to, well, sign off. And as I always say, and I see you all uh, next time. See you in the metaphors. Bye-bye. See ya uh, later.